what is good everybody welcome back to my youtube channel so today i'm gonna show you guys how to do this free stream transition on a like motion it's pretty simple and easy to do anyone can do it so if you stick with me during this video you'll be able to do it really easily So first what you'll have to put in your I like motion project is your two clips. Now once you have your two clips, you're gonna have to go on the first frame of the following clip. Now what you're gonna do now is just take a screenshot of this first frame and you're gonna download it. Now once you do that, you'll have to mask the subject from the picture. There's multiple ways to do it. The I like motion way is to just import the picture and just start masking so what you're gonna do is click on plus click on vector drawing and i'll just start drawing a shape around it now if you do this and you don't know where the subject is anymore you can just go on blending and opacity and just tune the opacity down a little bit and go back to edit points. You still can edit points in the process of doing the shape. This is really useful. And if you wanna go back to the editing mode, just drag this down to the plus and keep going. Now to fill it up, just click on this circle right there and click there. Now it's completed. If you have some curvy parts, all you can do is select the point right there and click on this. It's gonna make a little curvy part. I can do this with this one too. Like this. It's gonna make the mask way smoother and more pleasing to watch. So yeah. So now we'll go back to blending and opacity tune it up to a hundred percent now go under and click on mask and click on mask right there what you're gonna do is select the shape by holding its layer like this and just click on the picture layer so what you can do now is put it slightly before the next clip start and here you get a freeze frame now as you can see the freeze frame doesn't stop now all you'll have to do is just cut it once the sudden clip starts like this it's really simple and if you want to go a little bit more in depth you still can do a little animation like i don't know something like a scale scale up yes scale it down gonna put it there and just add your graph and you can just put a motion blur effect to hide these harsh corners and here we go this is a simple effect really effective to do that's about it if you like the video don't hesitate to like comment subscribe to my youtube channel go ahead and follow me on instagram tiktok if you're an i like motion user don't hesitate to buy my vfx pack it will be in the description and see you guys in another video